And react to this video here, Knox. Transgender hate mail, homosexual hate mail, atheist hate mail. Basically, when you react to a bunch of screen caps on YouTube, even aren't there in response to comments I made against these demon lifestyles and a few other things. Trigger warning. If you don't like what I'm saying, go ahead and click off the video. Don't lie and say there's hate speech, hate speech in my face, my videos, not face. Hate speech in my videos. Mm. Also, don't lie that they say there's illegal stuff in my face. <laughs> Either. You know Hey, your video's all uploaded. Oh, mm, very nice. Mm. Here you go. Rest. Now, let's see here. Uh, yeah. There's, there's no hate speech in my faves. In my videos. No hate speech in my videos. Mm -hmm. There may be. I don't know if there's hate speech in my face. I don't know. Wait, wait. Uh, it's speech you hate. That's a different story. Mm -hmm. right. Um, let's see here. Uh, let's continue on with more hate speech. Well, with hate mail, not hate speech, hate mail. Mm, basically, uh, <laughs> oh boy, hate mail. Girl, you know, these, this one a girl who wants to be a boy who, um, taking male hormones so she can grow facial hair. Facial hair. Oh, crap. Uh, zoom out. Zoom out. Back up. Back up. Yeah. Uh, so she can grow facial hair, uh, and so she, and she can lie more about being a boy. Is um, uh, made a video being angry about um, the Prager U, well, who's I believe is Christian, oh, just about a uh, group who are talking, maybe Christian, I don't know, but they're definitely right wing, you know, something. And they're talking about, oh, uh, there was a video made, they made about the transgender, um, a lifestyle, especially from females' point of view, as a white girls become boys, they call it. So basically, she's basically hating on that and showing off clips. And they're basically, there are people coming in trying to try to support her, basically say, I agree with you. Here's what happened with me. Here's what happened with this. Here's what they're probably thinking. You know, I'm trying to set them straight here. So let's hear, uh, let's hear. Makes sense that a transgender would have a transgender friend. Mm, yeah, I don't know. It makes sense that a person who's confused about biological sex and identity would have a person, also a friend who's confused about sexual, biological sex and identity. Even with the low uh, rate of trans people, low percentage rates of trans people, supposedly, uh, because they can identify without realizing it, that there is someone who understands the same feelings they are feeling about their bodies and their minds and their lives. Mm. But yeah, that stuff is, uh, when you get it wrong, you get it wrong. It doesn't matter. Go. Mm. So it says, I'm a comfortable, I'm a 50, 15 year old, comfortable and skinned girl who has been interacting with and watching content from trans people since I am 12. You guys failed at brainwashing me. <laughs> you know, no, I thumbs up. Thank you. Watching me. I don't know why, yeah. That's the whole thing for his own thing. Well, 21 replies. I'll check that out sometime. Someone says, My handsome son came out and I was trans when he was 17. I actually questioned him in a year prior because I saw him. I saw him presenting, lying about his bicycle sex. Mm. Uh, I am bi, and he came out to me when he was 14 ish and is still scared to come out to me. I immediately started him in therapy so he can begin the process in the correct manner so he can quickly know the path he would like to consider in terms of surgery. Mm, bull crap. Mm, you know, genital mutilation. Even kids with accepting parents, it's still he hasn't to come out to them. Just love your kids. That's literally our entire job. Mm. Of course, also stop them from making mistakes. <laughs> you know, bad mistakes and really messing their lives up. As you need to be doing, stop messing around. That. Don't don't get them surgery. You know, get them therapy to stop that stuff. You know, no, no. There's some people that say, well, yeah. So he's gonna get beaten. I like, know. He's gonna be told the truth. You know that a person more test schools can never be female. Well, the can never be male. They should not try to. You have to learn to live with what they have. You know, that's what they need to learn. And the sad ever people freaking out over that. Let's go. Uh, someone says, as someone who graduated high school nearly a decade ago, I confirm that she is 100% lying about no one knowing any trans kids in high school back then. Because mm -hmm, you know? we, the people we saw, we decided to go, the thing, believe are trans, even though they, meant they were not, because mm -hmm. uh, no one actually is trans. Mm -hmm, you know, people are different, and they believe they get confused about what is male, what is female, and they think, yeah, we, we, you know, I think I'll feel better if I lie. Mm -hmm, you know, like that's not right. Continue mm -hmm, you on here. Someone says, all right, so hear me out. Mm -hmm. No, you too. Okay. All right, someone, oh yeah, so uh, hear me, so hear me out, says, says somebody. I had a cat. Oh, the cat one. I like the cat one. <laughs> oh, yes, let's go. I had a cat, and I know this is a weird way to start an antidote, the, the antidote. We always thought it was a female cat. We had it since it was a kitten. We adored it. We thought the cat was female since it was a kitten when we adopted it because no one in the house knew how to tell the difference. The cat was the queen of the house, and everybody loved it. 
And one day we discovered it was a meal cat instead. My mom was shocked and mildly horrified. My grandma, grandma didn't much care about it anyway. My stepfather had the worst reaction of all. Poor thing passed from being his favorite cat on earth to being worse than dirt. And the punchline of every joke because he was male and he had deceived him its whole life or something stupid like that. He even got physical with it when it tried to snuggle with him at first until it learned better. The worst part is the poor cat couldn't understand why everyone but me treated it differently now. It was still the same exact cat. Mm. It had always been male. Mm. Just that no one was able to see it until it grew up enough to be able to show them better. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Physically. <laughs> it backfires. This stuff backfires on them because it's a deal. The cat was always physically male. <laughs> okay. This isn't a female cat that's like acts like a male. Mm. Supposedly, you know, or a male cat that acts like a female, supposedly, you know, this is a cat that is physically male. The perception of the cat was the problem here. They assumed it was a female cat and they treated it differently than they would have a male cat because of the people around the cat. That was the problem. Not the cat. <laughs> okay. Same stuff with the transgender lifestyle. They want to affect perception. <laughs> okay. Because you know, they are afraid of the lies they're told about what goes on there. <laughs> you know, that's the problem here. Continue on here. Now, since you directed the way towards my cat, if I come out as trans masculine, a girl wants to be a boy. You know, in my case, non binary girl wants to be a boy. <laughs> what do you think they would have done in interaction to me? <laughs> Seriously, why do people think girls want to become boys because they're told it solves all the problems and it's, it's easier because they, they heard it was all the problems and it become easier. And boys heard the same stuff. Mm, it's all lies. Yeah, I shouldn't be doing that. Uh, is, there, is, is it is even slightly a reasonable argument to make? Mm, yeah. Mm, being trans is not an easy fix, but people do it anyway. So apparently it seems that way. Mm, yeah. After all, it usually makes your life harder because of lies. So don't do it. <laughs> you, know? you don't come out because it's easier. Yeah, you do. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> oh my gosh, you do. <laughs> you are know, able to be yourself through lies. <laughs> You know, I say you come out to be yourself, like through lies or by disguising yourself as someone else. That doesn't sound right. <laughs> you know, it's not right. It's not right. You no, know, make sure the cat's cool. And then, uh, yeah, there's over 112 replies on this. You know, and I got them, I think. I'm pretty sure I got those. So I'll check them out. But let's see what, how much time you got. You got time. Yeah. You want to hear someone says that a trans man girl was be a boy from Colorado, Ohio. When I came out as trans, I was sent to a conversion camp on three different occasions. I now have been on testosterone for three years, poisoned myself with testosterone for three years, almost four. And unfortunately, none of my family are around to support me because that stuff is after. <clears throat> but my adoptive son is. He turned four in April. You turn four in April. When your family isn't supportive, make a new one and love them. Continue to run from your problems. <laughs> you know, run from your problems. Run from reality. Stay in Wonderland, jerk. <laughs> Stay in the Matrix. Do this. <laughs> and I'm like, no. Don't do that. <laughs> you know, face reality, friends. Let's go. Someone says, my cousin was questioning their gender. AFAB. Female at birth. Girl. Let's be a boy. Then my grandma gave me the Universal Damage book. Told me a little bit about it and said, I know you're a huge LGBTQ supporter, so I thought you might find it interesting. No, I'm no, I am a huge supporter of the LGBT community. But I know this book is full of garbage, truth, uh, by just a few. Mm -mm -mm. Right? Oh, oh mm -mm. more of this stuff here. God, I'm sorry to my schedule. That doesn't sound right. And also, the cat was always physically male. Mm. The perception of like what he, what he was has, was changed. That is the fault of the people around the cat, not the cat itself. Mm. You know, no likes, but you know, it's the truth. Mm. You know, go, yeah. go. Yeah. Oh, this is another one. Mm. This is some different one. This is from the same, you know, um line of uh comments but it's a different one i think wait hold on hold up or it's just for the few dot 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 i guess uh click okay someone oh okay what part five did i get the whole thing no 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 back 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 we'll go this one here's another one uh, another uh comment mm by this person getting it wrong. And someone says, well, it's happening. And I referred it before, mm -hmm. you know, I wanted to go back. Mm -hmm. So you got some girl mm, going through puberty. 
Oh, I wanted to go back. I remember wishing desperately holding a plush with my eyes closed tight. Still so from crying the day from panic attacks because things got really wild when my period hit. Yep, female. <clears throat> Period's a female. Uh, wishing that time would go back to that morning when I woke up, except it would be the same without the period thing. But uh, I'm sorry. What were you told? <laughs> what lies are you told that make you afraid of your period? <laughs> of this normal thing that happens to females? <laughs>